And in my mind, I don't got to apologize to no motherfucking pussy asshole, bitch. I don't apologize to her. Okay, hello. Hi, hello. Hey, hi, everybody. Hi. Everyone say hi to Armand. Hi, okay. hello. Hey, so I'm doing, it's been a busy day, but okay. um, I just want to, because I want to, I want to, I want to just kind of clear the air on what happened uh -huh. today, because uh -huh. then I want to move on. But yes. um, I need you to understand where I'm coming from a little bit, uh -huh. because here's the thing. I know it may came across that you were in the live, you were in the live with Sean and, um, I said, oh, I pussy hoe like, what I say? Uh, I don't owe no pussy hoe, no apology. Mm -hmm. Right? And then, so you took that, and which is fine. Because, I mean, you could have you could have taken that. But the issue that I have is that when these stories are going around, and I understand that it's clicks, views, this, and the third. But when the story's going around, it came across like, I tried to shade you yesterday, which I did. So I came into your chat. I said, hey. I recognize you from being an applicant. I'm like, oh, this is the guy. I've been watching you for a minute. Mm -hmm. I was, I've been, I've been watching you. I typed in your Instagram. I noticed that you didn't follow me. So I'm like, okay, how does this person want to be on the voice chat? He don't even follow me. But I'm gonna keep watching. <laughs> I said I'm gonna keep because I watch everything, right? So I said, hey. he, don't follow me on, he don't even follow me on Instagram. So how you want to be a part of my show? But okay, whatever. I'm gonna keep watching. See, you see, Armand, that's that entitlement. No, 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 no. But I have to do it. I'm gonna tell. I'm getting to my point though. Okay, I, okay. I'm gonna tell you why I have to do it. So I said, I'm going to keep watching. I said, oh, wow, look, he got this Jaguar team. Sent, sent you a DM, let you know, like, hey, not a DM, sent you a message. Oh, yo, oh, what's up? Oh, that's mm -hmm. good. I'm going to take it. You know, put it up there. When I said I could have been shady and crafted, this is a dirty game. When right. people want to not give credit, they cannot give credit. So I said, hey, he's a he's an up-and-coming YouTuber. Check him out. My people came over here. I don't have a problem with doing that, especially if I'm looking for you to be a part of my podcast, who, which I've emailed, which I've emailed, sent the, yes. the follow-up email. So then it turned I've been into... I telling my people that so, I'm in the planet. So right, so right. So then this turned into a live audition at this point because I'm like, okay, let me see how he can handle a Jaguar right. So I'm watching. And then this is where it starts getting confused and this is why I called in because a lot of people are not talking about this. A lot of people like to make Armand the big bad wolf because I said a pussy hoe. But a lot of people don't remember that you went live yesterday, right after. Mm -hmm. And without knowing how I felt about a situation, you thought that a caller may have pers made a like persuaded me to think something different. So you got on your platform. It was like, and I don't need this, and I, I a bitch, I am that bitch, and if, I, if it mess up an opportunity for me, I don't give a fuck, and da and I'm like, why is Miss Mama's going off like this? I ain't even saying nothing. I'm just trying to figure out, like, I never said anything. He was like, and, and, and I worked for Prince, and I did, I didn't get these places, and I didn't did this, and I didn't did that. So hold on. So I'm like, okay, so he's so he'll go off. I said, okay, let me just, okay, let me, let me just, let me take a step back for a little bit. Then I went. The video was private. I'm like, oh, okay, so he realized that probably was. Not the best thing to do. Because it was a bad look and I deleted it. Right, right. But nobody knows that you said that. You were, no, you were low key shading me yesterday. Nobody knows that. So no, then they we, know. They know. They called me out. So then when we pull up, so then when we pull up, when we pull up to Sean Davey Way, there's that same energy a little bit from last night. Then there's the Jaguar right, which I realized, okay, I see what's going on here. But then she's saying that I need to apologize to you. But you didn't say anything on Sean Davy Way's show. The moment that you opened your mouth on his show was when he said that she should apologize to me. And the first thing you said is they should apologize to each other. And in my mind, I don't got to apologize to no motherfucking pussy asshole, bitch. I don't apologize to her. The That's fuck what you're talking mean. about. Listen, so thanks. then, wait. So, okay. so then, so you think I should apologize to her. She think I should apologize to you. And I'm over here like, bitch, I don't got to apologize to none of these motherfuckers. I didn't do nothing to nobody. So then, here you go. So then, I, but, but, but in my mind, because I'm already like, okay, he don't follow me, but I'm going to watch him. But then he do, he has a, he, he can go off. I said, but listen, this could be Wiley number two. So I said, he in California, though, he close. Let's try to give this a chance. But I'm like, the nigga still don't follow me. So I don't understand how you want to do this. But I'm going to see what's going on. I said, okay, I'm going to watch it. I said, I'm going to watch it. I said, okay, so let me go out here and give him some Armand energy. I said, bitch, 
I don't need a pussy or asshole for nothing because that's how I talk. Like it or love it. If, yeah. we, if we ever do business together, that's how I talk. It just is what it is. Like, it's right, right, my right. personality. And so when I when I work with people, I got to see if they're going to jail because me and my friends, we do that. And so in, in, this, in this business of entertainment, you want to make sure that a motherfucker is not going to go speak out at the minute of discourse. So then, so then when I, the minute I said something that you didn't like, it was all of a sudden, oh, you hate black, you were alive all day. And I'm like, bingo. That's what I was waiting for. Thank you. Because now you showed me what you will really do. Now, could you imagine if I flew you down here, we got cool, you got into my personal life because you in the voice chat, and then I say, hey, I don't like this. Then it's, bitch, I don't fucking need you. Your house is raggedy. Anyway, let me tell y'all about Armand. I'm like, okay, that's the energy. I that's about. the same energy you gave me when supposedly we're supposed to be supporting each other. And then you like, I don't want pussy ass. But when I kept, I kept giving you flowers, Armand. I but my thing is, you took that like it, you're missing it. You said that I should apologize to Jaguar, right? I said y'all apologize to each other. Exactly. So how did that become about you? Because you made it about me when you said you didn't owe a pussy hole motherfucking thing when Sean was talking about me. That was no. That was I I brought that up. I said go back and watch the video. I said the first things first. I don't owe a pussy hole. But listen, we were talking about cloud chasers, and I was so excited to do the interview. Listen, but 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 your argument all day was pussy hole. So if we're gonna talk about it, you suggested that I apologize to Jaguar Wright, and I don't owe that bitch a motherfucking thing. <laughs> I mean that now, <laughs> and I meant to see it. I definitely understand that perspective. That so, has nothing so, so my thing is this. So my thing is this. You took that and you admit, which is fine. But I just want I just want people to understand. You already had an energy from the night before that nobody knew about. You were shading me before I even had said anything. Because you were like this little YouTuber, which is fine. You are a smaller YouTuber. That's a fact. Right. And so are you. That's fine. But like I said, I mean that's. That's not no like I'm not I'm not I don't care about that like right. that's not that doesn't either. hurt my feelings right Exit. same here so you went on but you went on live and you you ranted and raved and you didn't say like so you ranted last night you mm -hmm. ranted and was throwing me shade and I said nothing to you you couldn't a, a, a caller called in and suggested that you didn't do a great interview job and then you you proceeded to talk about your accolades and how you don't need YouTube and how and which I'm like. What is all this? And then the next day, you're suggesting that I apologize to Jaguar, right? So my thing is this. If we're going to talk about it, let's really talk about it. And my thing is, I never had a problem with you. I just don't like a person. And it's not it's nothing to do with you. I just watch how a person moves. So in life, you do plant seeds. You got to see how a person handles discourse. So for me, I don't like people that I feel like we can't have a disagreement because then all of a sudden, it's fuck you. And this is what I've really been feeling. Like to go live on some shit like that, that it, it had nothing to do about the skills. You're a new YouTuber. I was even defending you on the thing. I'm like, he's a new YouTuber. Like I can work with him. Niggas close. But the only thing is I can't work with a nigga that's going to be mad at me one day and think that I'm feeling myself. So they think they're going to expose me for, for some fucking clout. That's crazy. I ain't putting myself in that situation. That was my whole thing with you. Nothing else. It was never no other shade because I don't care. It's not no tea like that. I was yeah. looking to fuck with you. But the thing that turned me off was it, it literally took you 30 seconds and then you're online airing me the fuck out. Because you disrespected me. Well, so we're going to agree to disagree. We have to because I felt like you were talking to me in that moment. Exactly. You, oh, you never funny. asked me anything. You felt like after you suggested that I go and give Jaguar Ryder. Well, I also, actually, I did DM you this morning and you didn't get my DM. So I, I mean, just it. But I was trying to have a conversation with you because I wanted us to have a dialogue before Sean and before all these other people so that we could talk. The people want to see us. So I was like, I want to work with you. They kept bringing you in my, you know, kept ch chatting, you know, mentioning your name in my chat. I'm like, I would love to work with Armand. I kept saying, you know what I'm saying? I even, listen. That's I, not the problem. Like my, my, like, and I'm with it. Like, But the thing is this. We're not, if we were to ever work together, we don't get, we're, we're not, everything is not puffed. So you could have had a disagreement and, and maybe that's just how you are and that's fine. But that was the thing for me, like, how, like you can't say that I was just talking about you when you suggested that I apologize to Jaguar, right? And that was really one of the only times you spoke. 
because I meant that because I'm a positive person. And the people seeing you two on cahoots would be better than you guys beefing. And you would right. have numbers having an interview with her and it being on a positive note and said you guys beefing. That's what I was coming from. And right. And I understand that. Bro. I understand that. But all I'm trying to get you to understand is I've been watching you. So I, I tried to paint a picture so you could understand my thought process from beginning to end. So then when there's a video that's response that I have nothing to do with from the night before that's now deleted that no one knows about. They know about all it. Day, they, all today. Yeah, and then we're it. only talking about we're only talking about the apology that Jaguar suggested that I give you and then it me and then my response. But we're not talking about the apology that you suggested that I owed her. Like, What's so bad about suggesting that though? Because because that's that's where my energy came from, where I don't owe a pussy hoe nothing. Like, right. that's what I'm saying. But, and I but, how, but then you took that and completely made it all the way about you. So far, you've been alive all day dragging me <laughs> and having everybody think that. That's what I'm saying. When you, right. like, so I'm just saying it. And so it wasn't really so much of you. It's more of a general, because I'm like, bitch, I'm not apologizing no fucking Jaguar, right? Got me fucked up. How did that become solely about you because i thought you were talking to me when you said pussy asshole because you before you gave that whole spiel you um told sean davy how you respected him so much because he's not a cloud chaser and he didn't get excited for having jaguar on his life and then that's when you proceeded to say listen i don't want a pussy hole motherfucking thing and i'm like you don't you're definitely right so but right back is where i draw the line because i don't need shit from nobody either Right. And I think that that's where it got confusing because I did feel that I did feel that way that you got excited because she got on the line. And, and that's true. But it I was talking true. in I general. I was excited, so that's not a read. No, that wasn't a read. But you, you're, you, I'm, I don't lie. So what you thought in that moment right. is true. And I, and I validated it. Uh -huh. Yeah. What you thought in that moment is true. I did feel like you got excited. I did. I did feel like that was what it was. And then when I seen you popping up on these different lives and then having lives streamed all day with my name in the title it's that does feel like a clout chase because it feels like okay the nigga they, don't even follow me on instagram it felt it's like a clout chase i'm proud. telling you why because the nigga didn't follow me on instagram how do you want to be no, a part of, of my podcast and you don't even follow me and then two the minute you think something is about you you go on live and try, try to blast me all day that's clout chasing energy to me that's how and i felt not, but it's no shame no, but that's fine because guess what? Your platform was built off of cloud chasing as well, just like everybody else. Listen, I'm not here. I'm not in here for a read battle. I'm actually going to get. Well, I know, but I'm just here to say facts. Okay, so yeah, facts. so that so so that's the fact. So that so those are your facts, okay. and, and listen, you're entitled those to it, and I think that you will do great. Thank I'm you. not even going to shade you, but I need you to understand. You had a video that you were throwing shade at me. I did I before. Did. That's now private, and uh -huh. you assumed that I was talking about you, and instead of coming to me. Or hitting me up, you went on live. You know, they proceeded times. to drag me because you were so Hollywood. You ignored me. I hit you up several times trying to have a Listen, conversation, bro. I, we're I not get a lot of that. emails. We're not going to do that. Listen, I, I'm sorry, I can't email. I can't. I don't have an assistant. I'm, I mean, like, I can't. Want, you got money now. Yeah, but I can't. I can't. I'm not looking for every. I'm not looking for your name. You don't even like what? That's crazy. But anyway, um, so that's just a thought. So. I got to get out of here. Hollywood a lot. Gag.